Com or 818-865-0605. to bring you a, I have two Cuban cigars and uh, and they're great. My neighbor gets them and uh, and uh, if there's a government agent listening to this, you can go to <laughs> Take it easy. Go to Tom's Joe house. Biden is tuned into the show. You got to be careful. He's ready to Don't ride screw the, around with me. Ready to ride the elevator. Believe me. You know what, uh, folks? Fred Dreyer show, ladies and gentlemen. Of course, uh, Mr. Dreyer back in session. Exactly. We're always back in session here. Oh. And uh, let's see, where were we? Yeah, Tomas, you got uh, Tomas is having fun in there. You know what that? He doing? Uh, he's just having fun. Who's 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 in there rubbing his stomach? I don't. <laughs> he's in there. He's on his, laying on his back. It's it's a, all right. So where are we okay, headed? Okay. Well, here's here's the deal. You know, uh, 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 Newt Gingrich, as I've said to you before, uh, is uh, fastly coming up through the pack. He's he's in the back stretch now. He's making a break for it. And uh, and uh, he's he's coming to the forefront because of a, a couple of specific reasons. Number one, there's a huge void in clarity, common sense, and reason. I think I think uh, uh, certainly uh, uh, most, if not all, of our candidates have it, except for that that lunatic, Ron uh, Paul. You know, uh, he's number three in the poll, though, isn't he? Is there uh, well, he, maybe in Iowa, I mean, he might be. You know, yeah, but, the but, Iowa. Poll. You know, after after he gets his uh, bit of uh, after they give him some, uh, you know, uh, some, he's still better than Barry, though. You got to admit, Ron Paul. Still, well, I, I would vote. I would vote for Tommy in there. Yeah, Tommy, I'm voting for you. Before I would vote for you know Barry. Thank you. Thank you. And uh, uh, so so uh, what we're we're dealing with now is. How does the base, how do the American people now uh, begin to look towards and start to centralize their focus on a couple of, of uh, our candidates? And they're going to be doing so, and I think uh, uh, Newt is coming to the forefront because he is, he is uh, cutting through this jumbled pile of lies with common sense and reason. You know, he's speaking to the people the right way. So we asked Newt, why does he think he's rising in the polls? Well, I think the voters are very concerned, the American people are very concerned about the economy, about a $2 trillion deficit, about a Washington that doesn't seem to work, where it's all bickering and partisanship. So I think they're looking for somebody who makes sense and who offers them an optimistic sense that we can get America to work again. And I think... Uh, week after week in the debates because I focus so much on substance and on positive solutions I think we've been steadily gaining ground uh, in the last week or so it seems to have, have increased dramatically the number of people who are interested in having you know the kind of positive solution oriented campaign so that's the key he's focusing on substance and positive solutions he's actually saying something out of anybody else that we've heard right well first of all it's it's not political rhetoric, right? It's truthful. He's just answering the questions people ask him, and he answers. Two and two is four, exactly. It's not two and two is five. I exactly. think Joe Biden would tell you two and two is five. Yes. Don't uh, screw around with me. And, and so, Take and it so, easy, Joe. Sorry, Joe. <laughs> I think you're getting very angry right now. He's ready. Well, to, well he he's, he's, he's in been elevator. in that elevator for eight years. He's ready to leave the office and come downstairs. Is what he's oh, trying to do. Right. Anyway, I, I don't. You know, I don't want to see Joe right now. I okay. I, I want to talk about news. Gotcha. And, uh, and uh, Newt is substantive and is talking about positive solutions rooted in elementary truth and common sense. And uh, 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 he's shooting up in the polls. Did you see uh, uh, the Hannity show, I think it was last night, when Frank Luntz had the uh, had the the, the, the uh, new poll out? The, the, uh, the conservative moms from Iowa on. And he asked them a series of questions like he always does. Frank's always great with this stuff. And, and he says, who do you think right now, who would you vote for to beat Barry? And, they, and, and you could see it. It was, it was almost unanimous. It was Newt. And, uh, and they had, they had uh, certain, there's other people in there too, you know, that were qualified. I think Michelle Bachman would give him a good tussle. I also think that uh, uh, Romney uh, would, would do a very good job. I'm voting, as I said before, I'm voting for whoever the nominee is. Even if it's Ron Paul, even Ron Paul, you even know. crazy Ron Paul, you know, anti uh, anti nuke uh, Ron Paul, 
and uh, and so so uh, nude it, it, right now is poised beautifully. And one of the things I asked him, you know, was uh, to articulate uh, about what the the main thrust of of American intervention. Uh, you know, uh, foreign this this hegemony, this this hegemonous uh, 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 policy America has had, uh, you know, in, in its history about imposing its will on on other countries, is that now we're in a time where we've got we've got for the first time in a long in, in ever we've got people in other countries who are uh, who have and are getting and working towards nuclear weapons. So the Patriot Act is very, very important to us. So he was asked about the Patriot Act. Timothy McVeigh succeeded. That's the whole point. Tim Timothy McVeigh killed a lot of Americans. I don't want a law that says, after we lose a major American city, we're sure gonna come and find you. I want a law that says, you try to take out an American city, we're gonna stop you. Exactly, and that and that and that tucks itself underneath what the Patriot Act is. There's there's more Newt, and there's straight more ahead, Patriot yeah. Act that's straight, straight ahead. ahead. And uh, we're going to come back and uh, join you with the last segment here very soon. And uh, we can't wait to talk with you folks further about this. And after all, it's the eve of Thanksgiving, my most favorite favorite holiday. By the way, talk to Fred. Go to uh, crntalk.com is our website www. Dot crntalk.com. You can reach Fred at fdryer at crni.net. That's fdryer at crni.net. Send him an email and uh, let him know what's happening. Yeah. We will uh, be back very shortly. Don't go away.